Do you like making small talk? Few people do. Now, it's something you can get better at over time, but why do we even do it? Now, I think it's one of those things that people feel like they have to do because it's the thing that people do, but I don't understand. And I work with clients all the time on how to be more comfortable in networking situations. Let's say you meet Bob at a neighborhood barbecue and you strike up a conversation. It's always about sports or weather or work, right? Now, the team could always be better if the coach would just... Or if you don't like the weather around here, just wait an hour and it'll change. Or the, there's this one. Things are just crazy busy at work right now. Now, there's never any meat to these conversations. Why not? I think people in new situations feel like they need to be guarded and keep it light, while at the same time they're hoping to talk about something other than the weather again. Now, you don't need to get personal, even though you probably could, but you can add some depth to the conversation by just taking it a step or two further. Hey, Bob, I'm Jeff. What do you do for a living? Well, I'm an accountant at ABC Corp. Well, cool. How does ABC provide value to its customers? Or you could go with, How'd you land that gig? Or why did you pick ABC? Or even how long before you jump ship and head over to XYZ, their biggest competitor? It's really not that much of a leap, but that little extra depth to your question, as well as a willingness to speak a little more in depth about your own position on things, can be the difference between a fluffy conversation that goes nowhere and a great conversation that leads to a relationship. It's important to be nice. It helps to be funny. But in this case, it's essential to be willing. Have I made you think? Want to hear a little bit more? I put up a new video like this one every Tuesday. You can subscribe to my channel by pressing that little red button right about there. YouTube may have moved it by the time you watch this, but I promise there's one on the page. You can also subscribe to my free weekly newsletter called The Parabola Press. You can find that at my website, www.parabolasales.com. And if you don't remember all the way back to high school geometry, it's in the liner notes, a real easy link to click. Thanks for being with me, and I hope to see you again next week.